Hey everybody, hope you're having a great traveling day. And yes, in my hand, I have the Duo Neck Pillow, the ultimate travel pillow. And I was really excited that it came because I've backed other products and never got them. So thank you company for delivering a product in a very timely fashion and great communication. In fact, I did some testing of the pillow. There was some questions out there as far as uh, holding the air and I reached out they gave me a suggestion and the product really has delivered. So really look forward to sharing with you. Uh, it's got uh, a number of different features. Uh, let me go ahead and take it out and then we'll talk about the all the different features. So very nice uh, nylon pouch. You've got your hook here that you can carry with like a carabiner outside of your bag. Uh, it says here range travel goods on the tag. Very nice material there. Got your drawstring opening it up. And then let's take it out. So it's got the, uh, the hood, which I'll demonstrate that, and the pillow. Now, first of all, this material is insanely soft. It's a very, very fine micro fleece material. Really, really soft. I was really wow when I, when I first touched this. I was like, wow, this is awesome. So nicely done. You First of all, you've got your air where you blow into the cap. They have a nice big area and two puffs. We'll fill it up, and they've got their logo right there, the Duo Travel Pillow. You also have a pouch here, uh, and I did test, as you can see here. I put my Galaxy Note 2 phone, so whether you have a, a Note 2 phone or you've got a, a smaller iPhone, uh, it looks like it will fit just fine. It might just stick out a little bit longer. And then lastly, it's got this zipper compartment here, and this whole pouch opens up and then you could take the bladder out and throw this outer cover into the wash so very very smart you know with germs this is great after that travel just take this out uh, throw it in the wash and you're good to go so let me go ahead oh and the other feature too is the two buttons for where we're going to connect the hoodie and then you've got your string for tightening that around your neck so let's go ahead and first blow this uh, the air in Let's see if we can do it two buffs, puffs again. All right, my first breath was not as much as my second breath. Let me put a little bit more in. Now, there were some concerns with the amount of air, uh, how it was holding up. So I did a test initially, filled it up and then put it down the table and then like 10 minutes later it was like really deflated. I was like, hmm, maybe a problem. So I wrote to the company and they said, well, you know, the valve, it works the way it's supposed to work. And they said, what you should try and do is fill it up and, you know, you put the, you know, pressure like you're, you know, putting your body on it and, and, and testing it. And so I refilled it up. Uh, it was around 10.30 last night uh, and now it's 3 o'clock this afternoon. So uh, almost 15 hours, I just left it on the table and you could see here uh, how much air was still in there. So uh, I'm not sure what I initially did. Maybe I didn't uh, put the cap back on properly, but the air did stay in. So uh, I would just, if you have a problem initially, it's not holding air, um, you know, just refill it up and try again and uh, see, otherwise reach back to the company. But again, they communicated very well regarding the uh, air issue. So a few things as far as the features, it does have uh, nine features. Uh, it's got multiple, let's see, multiple uses. It does. You'd be able to wear this four different ways. Cell phone pocket, which I uh, just shared with you. Easy travel, lightweight, machine washable, soft touch, wide mouth air valve, removable hood, and adjustable. So Let's go ahead and show you the different ways that you can use it. Uh, so the first way is if you like to just lean with your tray, you can just put it up to your neck like this and then lean forward so you can hold it this way. The second way is you put this to your back of your neck and then you just tighten the string like this and then you can just lean back. The next way is having it where this is in the upward position and then again, you would just tighten the string and then lean back. And then the fourth way, which is great, where you don't need to lean forward with the tray is 
put the string behind you. And let me just make that even. Wrap this around so this is now leaning on your front. I apologize if the microphone is picking up any noise. And now when you sleep, close your eyes, and then you've got this bar here that's supporting your neck. So very, very cool. Now, the next thing is you can use this hoodie. So you can, um, it's got the snaps here. So if you want the bar, you can actually, I think, use the hoodie a few different ways. Let me go ahead and you now, let me see if I, oh, I put this on the wrong way. So this actually goes in the, the front here. Let's see. All right, so it goes like this and like this. And so now if you want to get a little shut eye and zone yourself out, what you can do is put this behind you, tighten the string behind you like that. And just do the string like that and then take the hood and now you can close your eyes and then you can take the drawstring and then now you can get some shut eye and you would just tighten that on the back as best as you can so you can do it that way the other way that you can do it is i was just looking at the photos you can do the reverse uh if you wanted to Let's see, I think there's another way that they were doing it, but uh, let's see. What if I, I think, let me take a quick peek here. Let's see, so if we do it this way, I guess this way would work. Two, if you don't want that bar in the front, so what you could do is go like this, and then put this in the front like this, tighten the string here around your neck, and then you can put this over your eyes like this, and then just tighten, tighten this, and then you can just enjoy your flight, lean back, and then you're good to go. So there's so many different ways that you can wear it. I'm still trying to remember uh, all the, the ways to put it on properly, but I think I did cover those. Uh, so all in all, I mean, this is a really nice product. I'm going to put a link where you can get more information. I think they're doing some pre-orders. And then when you're done, just push this uh, piece in here, the rubber piece, to let the air out. And then you just whip, let all that air out there. And you put this back in the pouch. And then you can throw, you take the, the bladder out and you can throw all three pieces into the wash and you are good to go. So, very nice product, uh, uh, it's, it's soft, so, you know, you can use it whether you want to lean back, lean forward, uh, and you can be comfortable. So, do let me know if you have any questions, but I think that they have delivered a nice product and then you're good to go for your next plane trip or you might even use it to travel on a train, uh, even in the car. So that's it. Let me know if you have any questions. Click on the link and I will be doing a review uh, as well, comparison with this other travel pillow that I did. Uh, so be sure to check my channel. All right, everybody. Have a great day and Duo Neck Pillow Company. Thank you for delivering a great, great product here. Uh, and I look forward to uh, getting use out of it. All right, everybody. Take care. We'll see you on the next video.